first loser's bracket. Everyone else was dancing, now what were you doing? Now. Nico coming back in versus Stev, Steve, by the way. Nico and Stev showing very close performance almost being able to take out their top seeds opponents in their first round. Both players are actually very powerful and I almost reckon they're quite underrated. This is really a very interesting match. See you next time on the dance floor! The first song is going to be very interesting with Flower. Flower being very streamy, even though it's quite low BPM. In the first match, we show we saw Nico with a lot of dominance. Went through those high BPM streams. So they. Honestly, it's hard to say. I'd like to say I have an advantage here, but instead of being a, um, an IQ player, you might have the advantage of the streams. To be honest, the one thing I love about this set is it's unpredictable. Both these players are insanely good at what they do.
one that gets 10 KPFC though. That's the area as the sheep record for sure. This could be interesting. This might go to the third round. Beaker having experience with this chart. Steph not. This chart is quite weird. So a lot of the anime songs tend to come from DDR. They do tend to have very weird gimmicks, but quite a high BPM. Beaker seems to be able to play that high BPM, but we're not sure if Steph can pull it off. This will be a very close match. I think Steph actually missed the first note. Then holding on to an MFC, even though. Nico holds on to a fantasy, but Steph's MA in the beginning is instantaneously giving him a 50 EX advantage. Dropping down to a great, a great sort of FC, missing on the first go, Nico's still holding on to her great FC. Steph's MA is very good here, holding on to a 30 EX lead, but Nico is pushing back, trying to make up that difference, making sure it does not extend any further. Steph unfortunately still going ahead around a 45 EX difference. Going to the course is definitely the hard part. This can be messed up. This is still anyone's game. We're only around halfway through this. Both players hit that first very well, even though it was quite unexpected. Steph slightly extending his suit there. This is just at around 75 in the X -ray. Nico playing very well though, still holding on to a great full cover. Steph having missed the first note. Steph breaking Nico slowly making up that distance, but it's still around an APX and it might be too long gone. Nico getting a great right at the end, missing right at the end as well. This looks like it might go to Steph. Great game from both players. A hundred EX difference and Steph takes the loser's bracket.